last time we were here, we envisioned something evil outside just staring at the building. No! No way! Oh, well, look at this right now. He is watching you through the window. I was just talking about that. Oh my god! Whether you believe in ghosts or not, this may totally creep you out. Oh! I told you! The majority are bad, dark forces, unhuman. Oh! Get brought it here! No! That door! No! No! Who killed this? The problem is a fire I'm burning now for 30 years. We want in! What the f? Guys, the time has come. This is our last time here in Virginia City. Boy, did we pick a good one for you. That's a sad day, man. You gonna miss this place? No, I got allergy! But there are a couple episodes that we still need to do, so we have to fly all the way back. Plus, you guys know Jason. We like Jason. Jason's a good guy. Sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> barely ever actually a good guy. He's a f head. Oh. First parallel park ever. First parallel park ever. In Virginia City. In Virginia City. Perfectly executed. First try. What are we doing here? Mexican restaurant. We're doing it again? Yeah. <laughs> We're already here. Uh, all right. Well, I guess uh, we'll be right back then. Food acquired, boys. Food has been back. I feel like we eat Mexican food like way too much. No, we don't have Taco Bell, it's only right. I hope, honestly, once we kick this Virginia City go, this whole Taco Bell spiel will go away. We even had Taco Bell today. Wait, what? You did, you had Taco Bell today. Dude, all we've had was Mexican food today. Is it weird that I'm feeling some sort of weird tingly sensation inside my urethra? Good. Oh there it is! Holy shit. It looks better too without snow. <laughs> Let's just be honest. And my toes aren't gonna fall off. I think right now, the only thing we can do is learn a little bit about this place. So let's do it. In 1869, there was a massive fire that had broken out in one of the deepest and most dangerous mines in the Comstock. Reaching a depth of 3,000 feet, sadly, rescue attempts were nearly impossible. The worst part is people had to watch this fire burn for over a week, knowing that no one would make it out alive. It is known that there were 37 miners that did not make it out of that mine fire, but rumors say that there could have been more miners down in the mine Shaft. Days later, once that fire had burnt out, they were able to retrieve as many bodies as possible. Unfortunately, with all of those deaths and stories in Virginia City during the winter, they could not give them a proper burial until it hit summer. So they had no choice but to store each and every one of these bodies inside the miner's cabin. This is the devil's cabin. The Whether you believe in ghosts or not, this may totally creep you out. Over the years, guests that have stayed inside this cabin have had some terrifying experiences. And since we last visited, it seems like these hauntings are only getting worse. There are two reputable stories that still really stand out to this day. One of the stories involves a man and a woman staying inside the cabin. Now, while they were asleep, they woke up to what sounded like dozens of people outside banging all over the cabin walls and windows. The man had decided to get up and check and found nothing outside. But when the woman got up to look, she noticed that there were handprints all over each and every window. Almost as if whatever was out there was trying to make its way inside. Last but not least, there's the story that gave us a reason not to want to go back. Some people tell of a darker entity that still lingers around on the land because of all the tragedy that had happened there. People believe that this entity could have been summoned there by death himself, almost like it's there to collect the souls of all of these dead miners. Some see a strange dark figure standing outside of the cabin, who is said to make knocks and noises outside trying to trick you into letting it in. Now it's important that it has been noted by guests and employees alike not 
not to interact with or give in to whatever it is this entity wants. Our goal here tonight is to make our way once again to this yellow jacket mine cabin, try and capture what we did last time. But before we do any of that, if you guys are not subscribed to this channel, we are so close to 600,000 subscribers. I'm pretty sure we only have 4,000 subscribers left till we hit that mark. So thank you everyone for giving us the chance. If you are not subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Also guys, please follow us on all of our other social medias because that is how we update you guys with all the information on a daily basis. All of those links will be down in the description. With all that being said, we hope you enjoyed this terrifying episode. Okay, guys, apparently we made our way back to Virginia City at the Yellow Jacket Mine Cabin! Woo! Yeah, my friend. Wait a second. Not! Woo! Nope, this place is f***ed up. <laughs> this place is literally one of the scariest places that we've done, but we thought it was fitting because you guys wanted to see it again before we left. So here we are. You're welcome. Didn't a handprint appear on the window? Yeah, it did. well, here's the thing. We don't 100% know if it had been there. Okay, but it was really weird because we tried to smudge it off, yeah, and it and was it, from the outside, and exactly. that night we were getting evil spirit that was outside, and why the f*** are we outside of the cabin right now? <laughs> also, what was super crazy, if you guys don't remember, that light right there kept going off, and it's a sensor light. I remember. Please don't make that go off tonight. <laughs> See, the only way to set that light off is if somebody walks by because it's a sensor light. Yep. It's a motion light. Yeah, go in front of that real quick. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't even work for humans. I don't know, man. <laughs> the handprint showing up and then the light turning on, that's weird. Guys, there is no better return location than this cabin because unfortunately we are moving away. So this for a little while is going to be the last location in Virginia City. We obviously have to make a return to the Piper's Opera House, which we will as soon as we get everything set up. We gotta buy plane tickets for ourselves and somebody else who's gonna help us with ground penetrating Radar. Pretty sure this is a drill, not a ground penetrator, but it's a nice drill. It's a penetrator of some kind. <laughs> Put your hands together, boys. We are going to do an amazing investigation. Oh my god. I finally got my kiss. <laughs> <laughs> On the count of three, you know what to do. One, two, three, yellow jacket mine. This is our rhyme. Let's go do some time. I think I did it. That was a good jingle, buddy. That was. It was a little bit different. I think we should be singers. Probably. I don't know. All right. You guys ready? Now are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Another door. <laughs> are you guys ready? I don't know if you remember any of us. We were here over two years ago. Now, if we remember right, there was some very odd things that happened to us here. So we decided to come back. What we are here for is to have a conversation with any of the miners. They were warning us about something evil that was outside. Before we start asking questions, I'd like to refresh your memory by introducing the three of us. My name is Ryan. My name is Wyatt. My name is River. Uh. That was a knock. The first thing I'd like to do is bring out a device that you can use your words, whether it's one word or a whole sentence. Guys, f holy f My arms instantly. Did you just, you heard that? I did. No. It sounded to me like it was a kind of a thump mixed with like a creak as if somebody heavy creaked the floor. Okay, I'm bringing out this device. Airplane mode. Like I said, if you can, please use your words. Come speak with us. Hiding! Instantly, as soon as I turned it on, hiding. Guys, I heard two footsteps behind me too, right when you turned that on. Listen. What is in? Whoa! Whoa, dude, that's not funny. That's actually terrifying. So maybe what I just heard, I don't know what. I heard, like I said, I heard a knock and then creaking, but I don't know if that could have been a knock on the door. If you're out there, knock on one of the windows. Prove that you're outside. I agree. 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 
Okay, let me rewind a little bit. When we were here the last time, do you guys remember, was it that someone... No, 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 no. That was knocking, that no. was knocking. Was out there and couldn't get in? That was it, right? I remember when we were here, it felt like we couldn't leave. Exactly. We were like trapped in, but they couldn't get in though. Unless we let him in. I mean, that is ringing a bell, I think you're right. Here's another thing I remembered also. The... Henry. Henry. Mind you guys, there is a list, before you continue, there is a list of, I think, maybe around 30-something names that were documented who had actually gotten taken out of the mine, but they were dead after the mine fire. No. That's what I was talking about behind me. If I remember, I don't, I'm not like fully, fully up to... <laughs> what? what the f***? <laughs> That's a birth. Something's going on, man. From my memory, I'm not exactly certain. The spirits that were in here, they said that we shouldn't let whatever was out there in. I remember that. Is there a Henry here? <laughs> you want to set those out? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Do you guys hear that? If a Henry's here and you want to speak to us and let us know whatever's out there, can you please talk to us? I'm gonna face it how we did last time. Oh, oh. Follow! Oh. Wait, we didn't let him in. I don't know. I don't know. We, wanna... we didn't invite anybody in. So I don't, I just don't remember. Was it that we had to invite someone in or just let him in? I don't know. We didn't let him in on purpose. What do you mean? We weren't comfortable with letting him in. Okay. I'm setting the device here. This is what we did last time with the music box. This is a motion sensor device. So if it detects any movement, it'll start to play music, just like the light outside. If there is anybody over there, down the hallway, if you can, approach us. Walk through this doorway. We have a device that'll detect your movement. So if you can, please, that'll kind of let us know what direction you are coming from. None of these devices are gonna harm you if you remember. I also have this other device if you remember. If you get near this metal antenna, this metal rod, it'll start to buzz and it'll start to light up all kinds of different colors depending on how close you are or how much energy you are using. I'm gonna go ahead and set it over here on this little coffee table. If at any point in time you'd like to show us where you are, please give us a sign. We are trying to find out who is in here with us. To our understanding, a lot of the miners that died... <gasps> oh no. A lot of the miners that died in the mine shaft, they had to store you in this building. The winters were too cold to bury you. The ground was too hard. We are trying to find out where this evil came from. Why are they trying to get in? What do they want? What? Was that you? No. You're f kidding me. I heard it too. Give us a sign, please. <gasps> Dark spirit. I was legitimately just about to say that this place is like making me tense and I have a weird feeling of like uh... I'm just being drained in general. Like lethargic. Yeah. I am like on edge. I was just talking about why this evil entity, how it got here. That dark spirit here with us right now? <laughs> Back, Back door! door. Oh, that! Oh my god dude, did you hear that knocking right before that? Yeah. Literally. <gasps> That door! I am a child. Guys, what the f just happened? How did that just happen? I wasn't even near it. Hello? I have to be right in front of this thing for it to go off. Did somebody just come in here? I'm not moving. Monster. Monster. Whoever just approached us, can you state your name? Can you tell us who or what you are? Make yourself known, please. Oh my f God, that was loud. Can you maybe give us information on why you don't want whatever is outside in here? Please. Who's another one? Peter. Peter. I'm gonna grab this list of names here. Miner! 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 No way! Guys! No way! Peter Miner. If there's a Peter on here. Peter! Peter!
Peter! There's oh. a Peter! No, Peter blew it. Are you here? Oh my god, dude, you're kidding. You're actually no. joking right now. I did, I did bad, bad things. things. <gasps> Whoever just approached us, can you tell us who you are or what you are? Make yourself known, please, is exactly what the I just said. Dude, what if what happened to, like, maybe it was a miner that was down there who was, like, not good. Okay, so here's the thing I'm gonna point out. Back in those days, miners, they would also associate themselves with the ladies of the knights here. And they weren't all the nicest people. Yeah, but I wonder if that's, like, what made them bad, though, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Outside of that, what did they do? Unless he had something to do with the fire. Whoever just said that, can you tell us what bad things exactly you did? It's okay. You can confess. Whoa, someone's right there, dude. Are you in here? Can you talk to us? Guys, careful! Did you guys just watch that? I didn't move at all. Who's in here with us? I'm gonna sit here. I don't want to uh, mess that up. I don't want to be the one to cause that to light up. Dude, dude, dude. Don't be afraid of us, please. If you understand what I am saying, please make yourself known. Give us a sign that you are in this room with us and you do understand. If there are any other miners as well, please state your name. What happened to you was very unfortunate. What? Guys. What the f did I just see? What? I just saw like a light over there, a glowing light right in the hallway. Almost as if the music box went off, but it didn't. <gasps> Holy <laughs> Thank you. What is outside? Guys, what? the light's on out there. There's nobody out there? I don't know. Can you see out that window? <laughs> Satan! Satan. Oh. No way. It just said Satan. Is it windy out there? Anything? I don't see the bushes moving at all. There's nothing that could blow in front of that. Light. I don't think that sets it off anyways, man. We just talked to the people down the road earlier as well. They just moved here and they said they do not feel right here. They came and stayed here mm -hmm. before they moved into that house down the road. And they said some weird stuff happened. And they see this light go on and off every other night. Are you guys trapped in here? By whatever's outside? What? What the f*** was that? Did you just move? Anybody? Whoa, I heard both of those. There was a different sound. I heard it. <gasps> I can't come in? I can't come in. Dude, what? Look below! I was just gonna say I heard something come from the hallway and get like that second thumping is like it got closer. I can't come in. Look below. The mine shaft is right below us. Yeah. Unfortunately, a lot of the miners couldn't come out. They're still down there, bro. Yeah. Apparently, some of the miners as well had to get treated in this cabin, too. What the f*** was that? That was right next to us. While they would get treated here, some of them didn't survive. A lot of them took their last breath in here. Is there any information you'd like to share with us that you didn't get to share with us the last time we were here? I wonder if they remember us. Maybe. Well, says maybe. Do you remember us at all? Is that possible? Do you have that kind of consciousness where you have a memory? These questions we're only trying to find out because we want to know if there is life after death. I'm what? I'm outside. I'm outside. Dude. Do it now. Oh, I'm outside, do it now. Oh, f Let them in? Is that what you want? You're trying to get in? More are coming. Oh my god. No, that's creepy, bro. Why can't you get in? What is stopping you? I hear that. Where is that? I don't know. This is too weird, man. Give us a sign, please. Peter, are you still here? Can you make yourself known? Is there anybody else here that can give us their name? It's the same window that we caught the handprint on. Maybe there's something that you want us to tell someone. Forbidden? Why can't you come inside? Oh, Forbidden? I wonder if someone did something that, like in here, did something to this building that stops them from coming inside. Yeah, but what exactly is it and why can't they come inside? What if life after death is 
like totally not what we like envision. What? Sorry, I don't mean to interrupt you. I think I just heard somebody cough in the back room. <gasps> Guys, before I continue, do you remember that we were told that that back room was used for sick miners and some of them would die? Oh, do you not remember that, Wyatt? I do. Think about this. They're in here and they're trapped inside, just like Beetlejuice, if you guys haven't seen Beetlejuice. What if there are other miners and there's something very evil that is trying to make its way inside? Oh, like a, just a barrier in general. Yes. <laughs> But that's the thing, that's why we question this. That's why we do what we do, is because we're trying to find out that kind of information. Evil! River's device just said evil. No. Yes. I don't know why that one didn't come out. Uh-uh. Who's in that back room? It just said Billy. There are others here. There are others here. Wait Billy. a minute. Why does that sound familiar? I don't know, that does sound Did familiar. Did we talk to Billy last time? I don't remember. Bro, that sounds familiar. This is a warning. This is a warning. I'm not seeing a Billy, but that doesn't mean that there wasn't a Billy. There were some people that they just could not get the information of who they were. It's true. Some of these people were foreign. So there's a Billy here, is that correct? You said there's others. <laughs> Whoa, what'd that just say? It just said, go there. That scared the out of me. Where do you want us to go? Yeah, what the is that? It's right in here. Can you make that device go off right there in the hallway? The one that plays music. If you can, manifest your energy. If you need energy, we have these devices. Use all the energy out of the devices. We appreciate the conversation. Thank you so much. We listen? Like they'll listen to us? Right here! What the f Where? Are you close by? We keep hearing what sounds like somebody down the hall. Can you please make your way over here? We won't harm you. We won't harm the ones in here? Thank you for letting us know. We have no bad intentions whatsoever. We just want to communicate with you. Find out exactly what happened. Maybe why you're here. Are we safe here? Whoa, no. Jesus Christ. I'm sorry. That actually scared the out of me. He is gone. Who was that right there? Creaking, creaking. Oh, Whoa. I told you. Hi. It just said, I'm listening to you. Thank you so much, dude. You heard that creaking, I right? Did. Mm -hmm. Are you Peter? Scratch. What the? F oh! Absolutely. Literally just answered. Bro, that was so loud. Was there somebody sick in that back room? Whoever's back there, if you're listening, if you can listen to us. Thank you for making this one go off. Can you knock on something back there? We would like to make our way over there, if you are okay with it. Sounds like it. Wait and see. In your room. Oh. Did they come over here with us? They're not back there anymore. That might make sense on why this went off and then River asked if they can set it off again. They said absolutely and it was a one chime. Almost as if somebody did this. So you're in here with us. Are you sitting down? Or did you go in that back? You made a sound. We Wait. asked him to make a sound. We Literally. Didn't. We didn't hear it. Oh, <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> evidence. It just said evidence. What the f***? No f***ing way did it just say that. So you understand what we are saying. This is fantastic. Let's put the REM pod back there. Oh, what if it goes idea. off then? Yeah. That's a good idea. I'm gonna do that. <gasps> There's no way. It just went off. Wait a second. Can you make that device down there go off? I'm not alone. I'm not alone. Who's with you? 
stranger. What the? Oh my god! It just said fire! Fire! Ooh! It legit just said fire! But it didn't come through! My. Oh sh. I need more energy! I need more energy. My device just said light and then it says I need more energy? To do it again? Feel free to use all of these electronic things that we brought, and you can use some of our energy as well. Yo, that light out there is on. Again? Again! No. My it's a trap! Holy oh. sh! My device said light! It just said it's a trap! Oh my god. You think something's trying to lure us out there? Maybe. No way. Whoever's back there said that they are accompanied by a stranger. A stranger. Wait a second, what does that mean though? Right? It's just that they are watching from outside, bro. I was just gonna say if what Ryan was saying earlier about the barrier is true, then it would make sense they wouldn't know who that is. I'm with you! Dude, this is getting intense. Do you guys remember the last time we were here? They said something. He killed us all! I just fought that all I camera. did bad things, he killed us all. Fire. Peter! He set fire! Oh my god, Ryan said earlier, what if he was the one that started the fire? No. Bro, we are getting so much so quick. Okay. Sorry, this is like hard to process. Guys, guys. the last time we were here, we got the same thing. Remember, we envisioned, we were like, dude, imagine something evil outside just staring at the building. That's Remember? Not funny. Do you dude, guys we remember that? We said that? Yes. Mm -hmm. Dude, I remember this so much because this was one of the craziest nights we've ever had here. So what happened with the fire? Was it done on purpose or was it an accident? Was that the window? Yeah, that was the window. Same thing happened to us last time. You guys remember that? Somebody was knocking on the window. Yeah, please close this. I don't want to accidentally look over and somebody's yeah. staring that. Well, I mean, if that gives us a chance to catch something on camera, why would we close them? Because we have a camera out there. We don't need to see with our own eyes. Especially something with black eyes or something. Nope. Not for me. Are you still out there, outside? Can you hear us at all? No! No I'm the way! Alone one. Look at this right now! He is watching you through the window! I was just talking about that! Oh my god! Guys, dude, can we close the we're curtains? We're done, we're done, dude. This is this is way too crazy. Can we close the curtains? We were literally just talking about the windows. I'm not closing the windows. Why would we close the windows? Because, think about it, they're watching us, just like I said. Did you film that? I filmed it. That's just too good to be true. Really. Instant. That's how we know. They are conscious. River. What's up, man? Come here. You guys want to see something crazy? That doesn't make any sense. Watch the window. Really? Instant. That's how we know. What? See that? What the f is that? Wait, where are we right now in that? Thing? We are in the kitchen. I'm pretty sure we're standing right in front of this. What does that look like? I don't know. But what's weird? Hang on, let Can me you zoom in more. Yeah. That's a handprint. I don't know if it's a handprint, but it is a hot spot. The drone is a thermal imaging camera. So what does thermal do? It has to be. It's a hot spot of something. Maybe it is a hand. So here's this one. Let's see. I'm going to find. See, already you can't even see it. Check this out. So it's not, it hasn't been there the whole time. No way, man. That's wild. So what, was there just a warm spot in the window? There was a warm spot in the window, but before that, our device, you have chocolate on your chin. <laughs> <laughs> before this, whatever pops up in the window, the device says he is watching you through the window. And then that pops up. It's seeking some sort of heat. And here's me standing right Oh my there. god, dude. Oh, you're in the kitchen. That's, That's the kitchen window. This is the kitchen window. The second window is the kitchen window, and Ryan's back is facing it right now. So the last time we were inside, right here is where we found the handprint the last time, two, over two years ago. And then here, there's a there's something. That's 
Weird. Who the hell? Yeah. Of all places, we might find something on the thermal drone. Lots of people always want to see our raw reaction when we're editing the video. So we're editing the video. I decided to pick up the camera because we discovered something weird. Now let's get back into the episode. That's just too good to be true. Really. Instant. That's how we know they are conscious. I mean, that kind of proves it. Did you just f you know? This is terrifying. Can you make that device go off in the hallway? Are you scared of what's outside too? True, true. If you can light that up, that'll kind of let us know. Let's hold on to that metal antenna. That no! a full grab. That's a full grab. They that understand. is a full grab. They understand us, dude. There is no possible way that they don't understand us right now. What do they want? Do you know? Do they want you to join them? Do they want us to join them? This is getting intense. I'm legitimately scared. The last time we were here, you guys remember this was scary. Yeah. Everybody says that this place has something weird that happens here. The interaction we just had was downright one of the most intelligent things we have ever captured. And it even said intelligent earlier. Yeah. They're here. I think what is going on is they're slowly gathering some, it's almost like charging. There are others here, again, just like a dead phone. If you wanna use it, you charge it. But if you use it right as if it has like a 1% battery, even if it's plugged in, it could die because you're using it. So these spirits, I feel like, don't have much energy because there's not a lot around here. We bring stuff. It just said 19. That's the door's number. That is the door's number. It just said 19. Oh. I swear to God, that is the door's number. Yes, I'm pretty positive it is too. Well, we can't open it to check. Well, okay, continuing. I feel like now that we have stuff for them to use the energy off of, I don't know, okay? I am not a professional. We do these to try and gather any information and get experience from it. Bad spirit. It just said bad spirit. That is so crazy that we're getting almost to the T the same stuff that we got the last, last time. time we were here. Stranger, again. Guys, I'm with the stranger, right? Okay. That's what it said. It said 19. There are others. Stranger. Whoever this stranger is, is unnamed. And you know what an unnamed entity usually is. That's such a f***ed up event that happened down below us in the mine. Correct. Correct. Whoa. Guys, this is too much. It could have conjured something up, bro. Whoa. Morgue. What the? This was a morgue. Oh my God. My whole body's really chilled up right now. <laughs> this is kind of f***ed up and I'm kind of over the whole night vision. Sorry, I'm moving around so much. I don't know what to do with myself. That's okay. <laughs> I'm like, sit down, relax. What was that? Somebody's coming. We hear you. Okay. Ghost town. What the f what this place is. It's one of the most popular ghost towns in the world. True. It just said true. What the It just said true. Who the f is here with us right now answering those questions? Whoever you are, you are very, very intelligent. Guys. Whoa, those were really f clear, man. I don't understand. Maybe that's someone else. A foreign student or a foreign... You said someone foreign, right? There were foreign miners. There were. Whoa, that's right I there. don't understand. That's right there. Inside! Dude? Somebody just come in here? Who's the intelligent one? Who's the one that understands exactly what we're saying? Somebody's speaking to us. Almost as if we have somebody else here. A conscious human. Nightmare. Nightmare. Did you just catch that? I was pointing at myself. Watching. Nightmare watching. I don't, I feel like I don't remember this place being that crazy, but. I do. I think what we should do is swap to your other camera so we have another angle in there. Yeah, true. And then I want to see if we can do a quick EVP session. Maybe they are. <laughs> Come, Come find, find me. me, bro. 
Come find me, spirit box. No, that gave me the chills. Me too. Dude, the Look at my arms, dude. Box, Look, bro. shine your phone real quick. What the? F okay, maybe that's what we need to do then. Yeah, I agree. All right, let's do an EVP. Okay, we are going to try this other method here. Whoever is in here with us, or if there is somebody really out there who is trying to make their way... Music box. Since you're right there, make no. your way over here. No way. This device right here in my hand, if you can see it, this is going to give us the ability to hear what your voice actually sounds like. So we are going to ask a couple of questions, and in between those questions, can you please speak loud and clear into this device and answer those questions? Okay, perfect. Thank you. Dude, they know exactly what we're f saying, man. That's the longest the music box has played All night. in a long time, even. Okay, I'm gonna start this. This is EVP1. There's a man named Peter. Are you in this room with us? Is this stranger still outside? How many spirits are inside this building? Okay, before we f start that EVP, someone is right back there, bro. Yeah. Did you hear that? Yeah. How was this? Did you hear it? Dude, that scared the f out of me. You guys ready? There's a man named Peter. Are you in this room with us? Yes! Seven. That was really clear. 37? Are you sure? I don't know. Wait a One second. Time. Is that you speaking to us right there? <laughs> 37! <gasps> There's 37 there! No. Guys, listen to this. It's so f clear. It says 37. No. Listen. I swear on everything. Listen. Thirty-seven. Thirty-seven. Yeah. Thirty-seven. There's like actual pronunciation to the seven. So it's true. Can you stand in front of that for a little bit, please? Are all of them conscious? Or is it just a couple of you? I'm gonna ask you that question through this device if you can answer that. Okay, this is EVP number two. Speak loud and clear, please. Since you just answered that question saying that there are 37 people here, are all of them conscious? Or is it just a couple of you? Why don't you guys leave this building? Is it possible? Do you know at all what that stranger is? They're answering us through the music box. For real. Okay, let's listen to this. Just a couple of us. 
sorry. We are all unconscious. Just a couple of us. Or is it just a couple of you? Dude? Somebody's right there. No, I know you guys leave this building. Is this possible? Do you know it all? Nothing. What that stranger is? Do that one more time. Sorry, we're gonna have to scrub through it real quick. Whoa. That's a hard one. That is tough. That is definitely a You can voice. hear it. There's something there. Yeah. Something's making that thing go off, man. Yeah. Way more than it was. And now we're back here. Oh! Where is that? That's, that's still at down the table. The no, that's at the table. That was right at the table. Got closer. Let's turn these other devices back on now. brought it here. No. Death brought it here. No. Do you know what that stranger is? What is happening? Oh, that's so sad. Wait a second. Death brought it here. That might even be what we were saying earlier. It could have been conjured. Guys, listen. That last EVP that you questioned, what if it said death? Oh, no way. Yo, something is going on here, man. Maybe. Maybe death. Can you let go? Let go completely. Guys, this is getting scary. Come speak into this device that's on the bed, please. What the f is going on? Below. Below. It just said below. Now you have energy. We can see that. Thank you. Let go, please. It's like they got up, let go, and then they walked that way. Yeah, that was something. Do you remember us by any chance? Can you kind of give us a sign, please? They just made a jingle once. What? That was a whistle. Uh-huh. That was f very clear. Okay, so we might have established that this stranger, this entity could be death or something else, we're not really sure. Is there any way to get it to talk to us? Are you able to communicate with it? What? Could be too. All the movement over there after we asked them to come over here for- Maybe! Just said maybe. Whoa. Is it okay if we try? I was gonna say all the movement over there after we asked them to come here for the EVPs. And now these have been like way silent. Yeah, way. They really did like migrate back. That's crazy. Let go. Thank you. That might have just answered what you just said. Maybe again. Maybe and maybe. What the f Maybe and maybe. I'm gonna sit here at this table. It just said maybe and maybe. So it might be able to communicate with us and it might be okay for us to try and do that. And mine says trickster. Whoa. What the f That's crazy. <laughs> Correct! Right. How do we communicate with it if it's stuck outside?
Are they still watching us through the window? We're just trying to get to the bottom of this because we did come a while back ago and we weren't getting a whole lot of information. I don't think you told us who's outside. Do you know who it is? What is that? I don't know. Please speak into these devices. Might have been another burst of energy like you were saying earlier. Dude, exactly. That's what I've been saying. It's very confusing, but they had so much. That device isn't even going off. As soon as we came in here, it's almost like they were like, I don't know, just don't fully trust us. <laughs> Did you go back to that back room? Maybe we should just go over there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's do it. Just said Peter again. No, it didn't. It did. Oh. Said. Don't. Don't stay. Don't talk. Stay. Talk. Whoa. What? As we're about to go back to this room where we thought Peter was. Peter, don't stay. Talk. Peter, are you back here? Wait for me. Certain know you. Certain know you. Oh, maybe they do remember us. Yo, Peter remembers us. You remember us, Peter? Look by the entrance. Wait, look by the entrance? This is literally the front door. I'm gonna set the REM pod right here. You guys want to just kind of sit in a circle? Both of us! Remember? They stranger! Said, they said somebody and there's a stranger with them. Who's this stranger? Are they the dark entity? Use your energy. You got this. Warning. Warning. That's the second time it said warning. That's true. If you're trying to warn us of something, you have to be more specific than that. I f told you. I told you. Ooh, that's f freaking me out. Does this stranger have a name? What was that? Was that a voice? Yeah. It was like a whisper. Dude, something's going on in there right now. Peter, what are you trying to warn us about? There's footsteps. There's somebody in there. Why? Why is that? Why does it happen to us? I don't know. It's like they try and distance themselves. Mm -hmm. Are you in the other room? Are you not right here next to us? Oh, no way. Something just tried to open that door. Something legit I just it. tried to open the door. Look in entrance. Dude, by the entrance. By the yeah. entrance. Something's waiting right outside that door. We hear you. Window! I remember you! Window, I remember you. That's the spirit, the spirit that's out there. Oh, good point, Griff. What window? What the f***, dude? I don't know. This is too f***ing weird, man. They're still not being clear about this warning. No. Are you just not allowed to talk about it? Would you be putting yourself in danger? I want to let you know that since we are around, nothing can harm you. And if I remember right, we tried this the last time we were here. We tried to help whoever wanted to leave this place leave. Now I'm starting to get the feeling that you didn't want to leave because you've been telling us that you are afraid of what's out there. It's totally understandable. If you feel more safe in this place, then that's okay. If at any point in time you do want our help, you gotta let us know though. This is f weird. This is creepy. Yeah. Is that music box on? Yeah.
That's actually really cool because it's not sensing us. It's not sensing anything that we have. Huh. So whatever was happening, that is legit. And whatever was just right here and is setting off the REM pod has to be between us and it. Yeah. Oh, that's true. That is true. Are you just standing here? It's just very difficult because we can't see you. That was loud. Whoa, was that above us? That sounded like the outside. The metal roof. You know, just before that went off, I swear I heard somebody either move or whisper again. No. Why? Doesn't this have a metal roof? Yeah, it's a tin. The whole thing is metal. That's what it's metal. Sound like. Yeah. It sounded like a bang Boom. on the metal. Mm hmm. Had an echo to it. What if something just jumped on the roof? Oh, Monster! No, dude. Peter, is that the warning you're trying to tell us? That entity that we were looking for? We were trying to talk to? Would that not be a good idea? Will you touch that for yes? Too many to count. Whoa. Give us a yes, please. Pull on the door. Yes. Thank you. Peter, should we not be in this room? We want in! What the f? Oh, no. Communicate! No, dude. Bro, we can't talk to it unless it comes inside. This is no. not gonna happen. No, no. Sorry, but we cannot let you in. There's a reason why you can't come in. You can. You can speak to us through the window. Dude, this is actually terrifying. Is that the door? Nope. Is that the door? I don't know. That's legitimately like a scary movie. This is a scary movie. I think what we should do now is dig a little bit deeper. We've been trying to get more into the Estes method. What do you guys think? Let's do it. We can do an Estes method session. I can see if I can do my best. Let's give it a shot. It's always worth it. Yeah. Let's do it. Okay. Right now, I am blindfolded. I'm going to put these headphones over my ears, and it's going to be switching through radio frequencies, giving the spirits the ability to use this device and tell me what they want to tell the guys while they are asking questions. So, this is the SS method. It is them. What the f Peter! Are you here right now? Outside. Wait and see. Whoa. Outside, wait and see. We might not be able to leave this place. Peter, is the stranger still with you? Why did you contact me? Mine. What the? Out. Actual Can you see that? Mine out right after that dude. Maybe here. the stranger. Here. Who's here? Is it the stranger? Quinn? Quinn, I don't know if there's a Quinn on the list. Williams? Quinn Williams? My device just said hateful. Hateful? Yes. Oh, it doesn't want to talk to us. William! Dude, there's a, there's William. There's two Williams. <gasps> Dude, wait, wait, wait! That's weird. William Williams. What? Yes. Two I'm dead serious. Yes. Yes! Oh, sh Two of them. Dude, Peter and the stranger. Outside. You gotta be kidding me. Someone's at the window. Can you see us right now out there? Can anyone see us? And I, I just asked them that too. What the f We can't see you. Dude, someone's right there. That's one of the trippiest things that's ever happened to us. Window. I 
just asked them if they could see us, and they asked us if we could see them. Peter, is that you outside? That was a tap. That was a tap. Right on the window. No. Is that... In the dark. In the dark. Come out. No, dude, stop. This is not real, man. This is not real. Can you make that light go on outside? Is it that stranger, that darker entity that asked why we contacted what? them? Still yeah, it is. No! No. It is? It is. I'm intelligent. Whoa, never got that. Uh-uh. Who are you? What are you? Who are you? The double question again. Oh my god, that was loud. I'm not liking this, man. Minor. Minor. What are you? We're stuck. No, dude. Is that stranger that you were talking about earlier, was he a miner too? Evil. No. Dude, we are hearing noises everywhere. What made him so evil? If he wasn't a miner, what's he doing here? He said death. No family. I don't know, man. Whoa. You said death brought him here earlier. Is it because of the disaster, everything that happened? I'm starting to get very dizzy. Uh-oh. Like, really dizzy. Who's communicating through Ryan right now? Is it you, Peter? Or is it the spirit that's outside? Death. Wait. Ooh. Didn't it say that earlier? I'm getting really dizzy, guys. Did you just hear It's that? like I'm spinning in a room. There was multiple knocks again. Do, 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 do. Why can't you come inside here? Stuck. He said that earlier. Trapped. Why are you stuck outside? Why can't you come inside? Or stuck inside? Or stuck down in the mine? There's so many different stucks there could be. God, I feel like I'm in a merry-go-round. I don't know if we should pull them out. I know. No. Standing there. No! Oh, is that Peter? Right there. Peter, are you okay with us being here? I know this other entity said he didn't want to talk to us. I'm in the house. Oh. No. No way. He got in. No. Dude, what should we do? Pull Ryan out? Should we pull Ryan out? I don't know. Run? How the f I don't know, that didn't sound right. We didn't open the door. I don't know. Who's in the house? Dude, that has to be a joke. No, it's not a joke. That just happened. I don't know, man. I, I don't know what to say. No to that. No to that. I don't know. I fold you. Imagine we open the door to try to get him out. He comes in. I fold you. Back door! No! No! Film this! Film this! Oh, He almost had us. Dude, he legit almost had us. I'm actually terrified. Peter, are you afraid of that entity? Is there something wrong with it? Is it not supposed to... Whoa. Is it not supposed to be here? Danger. Peter, do you need help from us? Watching you. No, dude. This is too f***ed up, man. I'm sorry. Starting to feel a weird pin point needle feeling in the back of my head. Light, 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 light. Dude, I'm getting a strange, like a sense of being surrounded. I don't know what to do in a situation like this. For real, what the f*** do we actually do? This is the feeling that we got the last time we were here. And we had to leave because we felt trapped like the spirits do. Peter, the one that's stuck outside, what does he want? What does it want? Can you tell us that? My hand. More fire. No, dude. Those were the loudest knocks. Holy and it said fire. He wants more fire. More death? 
This house lights up right now and oh we die. Okay, I say we get him out. I, I don't know if this is actually safe. He is having a weird physical reaction to it this time. You need to leave now. Peter. That just gave me the chills, dude. Okay, I'm gonna get go Ryan. now. I'm gonna get Ryan out. And then I don't know. I don't know what to do, man. We're respecting your warning. We're gonna get out of here, okay? We're gonna pull Ryan out from this now. Thank you for speaking with us, though. Okay, I'm gonna get him out. Yeah. I think we're good, man. Yeah, I'm like really dizzy, man. It feels like I'm constantly spinning right. That was super freaky. Dude, you don't know the sounds we just heard in this house. Dude, that thing outside almost tricked us. You said he got in. The device said back door. And then there was three knocks on this door right here. Boom, boom, boom. Really? Yeah. Loud? We were about to open the door to try to get it out. It almost tricked us to let it in. That's not scary at all. No, bro, that one was f***ed up. And you guys let me continue to sit here? That was not, like, long before we were I mean, getting him out of the this. Hold up, if the door- Shh. What the f*** was that? You guys wanna hear what I hear? That's what I hear. Okay. I think we're good. Sorry to all the spirits here. We love you and we hope the best for you. Hopefully we can get out. I don't know, man. I mean, I, they said you need to leave now or something like that. Yeah. That's what I, it was clear. Very clear. That was, we asked Peter to tell us if it's okay, if we should even be. Oh, that was an answer to you guys? Mm -hmm. Okay. He was pretty That's obviously it. somebody telling us we need to go for some reason. Mm -hmm. The same thing happened like that last time. I don't know. Dude, I like, this place is terrifying, but I'm not gonna lie. I actually really like this place. Oh! If there are any innocent spirits in this house, in this cabin, we're gonna give you this option one more time. As soon as we open the front door, you are going to use us. Let us in! As soon as we open the front door, let us in. The odds. Dude, you cannot come in unless if you mean zero harm. If you mean no harm, then okay. We're only going to let spirits out, not in. If the spirits that are in here want to go because they don't like it, they are free to leave. But the spirits that mean harm that are outside, you're not welcome inside this house. This cabin. And as soon as we do open that front door, use us as a guide to get out. You are going to see a bright white light and please manifest your energy, get past this barrier, and move on. We wanted to say thank you again for giving us all this information. We are very sorry what happened to you. That mind fire was very sad. And none of you are going to be forgotten. Okay guys, I think before we start stirring a little bit more up, it might be a good idea to leave. Mm -hmm. It's rare that we ever do make returns to places, and it's rare for me to say this, but I'm going to say it now. Is that weird? We've never done that. I'm just scared because, like, what if it gets worse? What if we do outside? Near the mine. Oh my god, dude. We can do here and the mine. We've never done that. You're joking. If you guys want to see that, please get this video to 40,000 likes. You guys have been killing it. We thank you guys for everything. We thank the new people who have given us a chance and subscribed to this channel. And the ones that have been around forever, thank you. We ask you guys to like the video because that lets us know that you guys do want us to do these things. You guys like what we're doing, so please like the video. Also, if you are new, and you haven't subscribed yet, but you keep finding yourselves coming back, please hit the subscribe button. One day, we will be at a million subscribers, which it's a goal. It's always a YouTuber's dream and goal. With all that being said, we will see you next week. Peace. I've been in your